the the narrative that hurts me is when they say in order for them to cross over, they got to get that 50 million, they got to put the dress on. That's what they say. So what hurts me in that narrative is, man, I don't think Tyler took 50 million to put the dress on. Now I understand if y'all feel like that's the only, I'm a great Tyler Perry fan, I think he make great moves, but this is my narrative about the whole dress thing. Al, going to be mad when I <laughs> Boy, He begged me not to say this here. And I'm going to say it. He begged me, he begged me not to say And I'm going to, I'm going to hurt some feelings with this here. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we going to talk. Man, you like, like, listen, man. I'm going to be real with you, man. I, I remember the day I had Mr. Lee in here, and I was saying, man, I got to get Kiki here, man. I'm so damn happy today. You don't understand, man. It's something I can't express it. You know what I'm <laughs> saying, love. man? Because I, cause I got a love for you, man. And it's it, like I said, Texas is something different for me, bro, Like, because I've seen the grind. I love I what you do with all that. You know that. what I'm saying? I love what you do for Texas, bringing in Mr. Lee's, the comedians, and all that. Man. And boy, you was the one telling me about the, com Which the comedian one? games. It's going crazy. <laughs> Them niggas is beefing harder than the Cat Williams. He just showed you. Now I started it. You got real. I was doing that way before. You know, for bringing the comedian when Shannon got Cat, it just blew up even more. But mm -hmm. I already knew. I'm like this. These niggas is not like. They the new rappers. They is really beefing. Yeah, like that. Man, I love everything. All of them cold. That's what's so I crazy. I text Bub last night. Dub, that's my pop. That's my boy, man. My you boy. know that. I love him. You know what I'm saying? I love, I love everything. I love Kieran Claiborne. He was just here. Yeah, Jeff that Shelley's man. anything. Yeah. I'm, I'm a. I'm a. You be acting at the, at the who, improv and stuff. Yeah, but who, like, who is who is your most like out of all the ones you've actually seen or maybe seen on social media? My favorite comedian. Yeah. Mike Gibbs, my favorite comedian. Mike Gibbs said they didn't mention Cat didn't mention it here when he doing that damn. <laughs> listen, what you talking about? And he getting all that damn money, man. Mike Gibbs, stop Mike it. Is, hey, listen, Mike is backyard, penitentiary, <laughs> um, eat top, top, drop the top. Mike is quick. <laughs> the, That's the my cause night. Everything. Family reunion yeah. crazy. Yeah. Mike, man, listen, man. Mike is my favorite comedian. Of all, all time. Now, I love, I got different types of comedians that I love. Now, Bernie, that's a different level, man. Well, that's a different, that's, that's, different dog that's in the my fight. Top, my boy top, top. Said. I call him Black. Black, my top. top. <laughs> okay, Black. top three comedians of all time. Oh, you gonna get him my, right there? Yes. Black off the top. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Burn him Don't back. play with Black. Mike Epps is one Number of my. Now, let, let me tell you so. Now let me tell you, I like white comedy too. Okay. Yeah, so yeah. So I got yeah. a couple of white favorites. Yeah. Like Adam Sandler, yeah, one yeah, of my yeah, favorites. I love, See, I, I ain't in the games. No, in no. Certain thing, in certain things. Now, I, only I, three. Name <laughs> three. I didn't now, three. I'm gonna take Adam Sandler out because he just. Because <laughs> I gotta have all three of my people in there. So I'm gonna go. <sighs> Black for sure. You said Bernie Mike, right? <laughs> Black, said Bernie. Mike Epps, and um. Who's this number three? And um, Tyler Perry. Tyler, Tyler Perry. Perry. Now, see, I got a narrative about Tyler Perry before I go. Okay. I'm very... I'm going to say this. I know somebody who say that Tyler Perry only... The movies that he make is not really great for men, so to say. Okay, I got a narrative for all that. <sighs> yeah. It I, showed black men in a... In a sometimes. That, did y'all yeah. see... Did y'all yeah, see... I, did, I, see yeah. I heard you. <laughs> uh, did y'all see Maxine Baby? No. That's what I'm saying. That's the when movie? You get, yeah, that's, that's Tyler's story. Maxine Baby. Maxine Baby. That's his story. Yes. I'm going, wow. how long ago that came out? I, it's on Prime. I need to find that. I tell everybody that give me the Tyler narrative, talk to me after Maxine Baby. I got to okay. watch Because this I'm is how I feel. You. I'm down with what Cat talking about. It's how I closed up. I'm down with what Cat So saying. you was cool with the Cat with the Cat Not women. everything. Yeah, because he <laughs> cut up on there. He, now I'm down with, hey, listen, I'm, I, I love Cat. I'm not saying, but I, this is my thing. The, the 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 dress thing that we going through, mm -hmm. yeah. right? Yeah, I had Eric Spears on there. He 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 justified the fact that a lot of comedians wearing dress. And back then, I'm gonna bring the dress thing up and all that. Son, relax. First off, I'm gonna put you up on that. <laughs> like I told you, you need to. Stay. Yeah. Like you was early on that. Like, do you think that this big facade where when you put this dress on, like we just had Brandon T. Jackson on here. He was yeah. saying after he wore the dress, he felt like you know. Like he, because of his belief system, that wasn't a thing for him. But you, but that's you've later done on, it he figured over that out. and over again. And, and we'll do it again. Because let me tell you something. That stigma, I don't buy into that. First of all, men in drag has always been a comedy staple. 
Okay, I got a different perspective on it. Including Tyler Perry. Okay. I'm not knocking nothing. I'm a street cat. I understand everywhere we're coming from. But one of the things that make... They ain't, pay, they ain't give Tyler 50 to get that dress. Tyler put that dress on with nothing. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Not a dollar. That's real. I ain't Tyler, that. Tyler put that dress on and ain't nobody in the crowd. Just, just at a play. dress. Tyler put that dress on by accident by somebody supposed to put that dress on and they didn't show up. Mm. If I'm not mistaken, wow. watch this Maxine, baby. Tyler on this road doing his plays, man. Tyler, for that's the only thing. I the the narrative that hurts me is when they say in order for them to cross over, they got to get that fifty million. They got to put the dress on. That's what they say. So what hurts me in that narrative is, man, I don't think Tyler took 50 million to put the dress on. Now I understand if y'all feel like that's the only, I'm a great Tyler Perry fan. I think he made great moves, but this is my narrative about the whole dress thing. Al, you're going to be mad when I <laughs> Boy, He begged me not to say no. this here, and I'm going to say it. He begged me, he begged me not to say and I'm going to, I'm going to hurt some feelings with this here. A lot of people going to be mad at me about this, but I really feel like this here. One of our biggest things in the black community that we messed up right now is about the dress, you know, if you're gay or if you're a snitch. You know, we're having a hell of a snitch run. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Paperwork. Yeah. Bad, bad paperwork we, party. We on a snitch run. Mm-hmm. So I, I I respect I'm from the street, so this is what killed me. We got cousins, partners, uncles, friends that, you know, get in a little trouble. Do what they ever they got to do, and they come home. And guess what we do? We accept them. We have mm-hmm. to. They family. Well, now we're in a new world. <laughs> now, now we're in a new world. They start back hustling. Mm, and yeah. guess what we call them? Big bro. What up, big bro? He, 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 you might be older than him. You call it him big, big bro. bro. They go down there. They do what they do. Same thing with this here. We got men who go to jail, and, you know, they come home with funny stories, and, we accept these people, man, back in our lives. You know, he might have did a little something funny down that we heard. Uh-huh. And when he got home, hey, his chest stuck out. He got another girlfriend and we accepting him. Yeah. Man, how can we accept these people, man, back in our life and, and keep it real with them and say it's a hundred with them and then turn around and tell Tyler and them they got the dress on? Mm. That's real. That's real. That's, I mean, you got you to gotta be real gonna, about it. We going we to gonna, we gonna no, con- agree. We going to condemn Tyler and them. We gonna condemn all the men. So, so now, if it's a narrative that that's what they doing, I'm with it. But we're gonna condemn them to the floor. He's a he's a he's a faggot. He wearing a dress. He doing his zip. But we got confirmation on some of our own people, and we accept them with no problem. It got to be the same across the board. Is we what gotta you keep saying. it on it. And the, the actors are only doing it for our amusement. Now, you mean to tell me that? This man ain't never helped you, done nothing on you, snitched on your cousin, everything. We're going to accept him back, and then we're going to condemn Kevin Hart for getting him 450 million. He doing white coming. He's, they say he kissed the white folks' ass. Well, this man here, these people finna get out. They not going to contribute a quarter back to the culture. But you saying he and kissed he the has- white folks' ass, and he done made... 20 more millionaires. Uh-huh. Five of his partners, three, mm-hmm. four people that work at the thing, but we gonna condemn him because we saying, oh, he, he under the white agenda. Well, home and them coming home and we calling them big bro. Mm-hmm. No, that's that's real talk. That's real talk. We calling them big bro. When they get home, hey man, they can come home from doing something we'll far. Party get, with them. get what we'll do. We'll take them out shoulder to shoulder the next day. Mm. And I'm not knocking it. So when we play an eclipse, I love I I got the I love these same people just like you love. But it's hard for me to accept these people right here, accept them back in my life, understand what's going on, know that this culture and this is and then turn around and tell Tyler, I ain't messing with you, man, you wearing that dress. I ain't gonna be able to do it. Wow. Hey man, I got a list. I show people a list. Hey man, I seen Robert De Niro, Dwayne Johnson. Clive Owen. I'm talking about um who else they had on there? Um Clooney. Mm-hmm. Big list. 500 million, 700. Clooney's them. You know Tyler sitting at that top with that B. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this no. bigger than company. For sure. And guess who was number 11? Oh. Kevin. Mm. Wow. wow. At 450. Mm. Why are we so big on their agenda, but we got 
They're not worried about us. They're not even tripping on us. <laughs> They're not worried about us. So, so my whole they thing, be. my whole thing is the only thing that I didn't like about the Cat in Williams interview because I loved it. I love Uncle Shay, but the only thing that I didn't like about it, hey man, we just went on a three week killing spree of us, blacks. We snitches. We fraud. Hey man, we we. Hey man, I just. Hey man, I was telling people I can't. Ain't no way. Robert De Niro gonna do Clooney like that. Mm-hmm. Ain't no way Al Pacino gonna do such a like that. Get up there and just, and we were just wrapped as a community and as a culture, man, we were super wrapped up in that thing. Our biggest thing for us right now in the culture is who gay and who a snitch. Yeah. That's our biggest yeah. thing. But the thing you gotta realize, man, that that thing went crazy. Everybody started watching it. I don't know if it was Cat's tone. It was something that made everybody in a mom. The things he was talking about. 50, they probably had 54 million now. To be Did you black. watch the whole thing? Because some people the, said they couldn't watch, watch the whole thing. I watched, I, I watched it. I watched, let me tell you something. I watched the whole thing. Me too. Because I thought, you know, my whole thing was, you know, I, 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 think, I think it was a little bit of both. What I mean is, it's some truth to it. You know, it's some exposing to it. But at the same time, this tone of voice watch this here. Cat is a master craftsman. So it wasn't all in genuine flow. It's some put together. I got this in mind. I'm a master craftsman. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I know exactly what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, he plotted all of that before. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? On. Like, I just so so for me, I think I, I looked it on both ways. I felt like it was great to hear it's great content. And at the same time, we took a L. Yeah, because of the way the culture was looked at. The culture, listen, man, we went on a spree of, hey, man, let me tell you something, man. Just imagine, man, imagine being all them. And listen, man, people don't understand that it don't matter how much money you get, how big you become sometime as a celebrity, we still human. So what I mean by that, we see who's skinning and grinning. When you grin, you in, we saw you. So... Some of y'all gonna have to walk back down some of these roads, man. That's why, let me tell you something, man. We got dilemmas going on in the city right now. And I tell people all the time, I may have a stiff opinion, but I'm not attaching my name and my comment to certain type of things mm. based on who I am. Now, I can have an outside conversation to it because I know across that stream what my like and what my comment means to that. And, and let me tell you something. Y'all think that these celebrities are all tough. They got soft skin, man. They got thin skin. A lot of them, you know, we, as for as many millions as you said, pay attention to them. So some of them likes and comments, they saw you. No, they definitely mm-hmm. see you, and they called me, so I know they see They saw you. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.